For the first time, TV ratings company Nielsen is monitoring people without TVs. WBBH describes what Nielsen is calling zero TV households. Some people have had it with TV. They've just had it. They have had enough of the 100 plus channel universe. They don't like timing their lives around network show schedules use DVR, and they're tired of $100 plus monthly bills. WPFO reports Nielsen counted 5 million zero TV residents in the U.S. in 2012. That's up from 2 million in 2007. Many of the people in the zero TV group are younger, single, and without children. Experts say they'll monitor whether they'll change their behavior over time. NPR reports subscriptions to online sites like Hulu, Netflix, and Amazon are climbing, eliminating the need for traditional viewing habits. This is a big concern for broadcasters as their ad revenues fall at alarming rates. The National Association of Broadcasters meets this week in Las Vegas and will discuss how to get those eyeballs and ad dollars back. Some say that could mean access to broadcast programming on all gadgets like tablets and mobile devices. The Inquisitor reports Nielsen will change its methods to adapt to zero TV households. Instead of specific ratings, the company will track what people are watching and what platforms they are using. The first batch of data is expected to surface later this year. For Newsy, I'm Katie Brennan, Multiple Sources, A Broader View.